on. Now's our only chance. Aha, you're trapped. I'm a level 14 thief and the Dark Lord's chief assassin, and you will all perish here and now. All done. Almost there. I should have started this sooner. You're gonna get it, Craig, you fucking traitor! Now let's see how you fare against the Dark Lord's Chief Assassin and a cow. Let's do it. Clyde had a much cooler base, so I did what I had to do. Why fight one, Craig, when you could fight five? I'm immune to splash damage, Clyde said. You should have turned evil when you had a chance. No more. Cool. I really found myself relating to Clyde's views about darkness and enslaving the world. Let's rumble. I can't. Just leave me behind. <laughs> Stop. Quit it, quit it, quit it. <laughs> Why fight one, Craig, when you can fight five? Yeah. 
Dull boy. Yeah. Help. It seems like oh. it'd be easy to find someone who could get small or could perform abortions, but both? the tip of my tongue. Nope. It's like the answer's right in front of us, staring us in the face. Fools, you thought you could conquer the Fortress of Darkness. Clyde, back away from that stuff. Oh, but I have yet to complete my army. You have come to witness the power of darkness. Stop! Clyde! You have no idea what that stuff is! Yeah, huh, it's green sauce from Taco Bell. I took it from their construction site. Dude, that's not Taco Bell sauce. Then why'd I find it at the Taco Bell? It leaked out of a UFO, Clyde! It's toxic goo from another galaxy! Think about it! Since when does Taco Bell have a green sauce, dude? Actually, since about a year ago. What? Taco Bell has green sauce now. No way! They've had it longer than a year. I've always gotten spicy green burritos. Yeah, no, I'm saying in the packets. They just started putting green sauce in packets. The fuck? How the fuck did I miss this? Ha ha! I don't seem so foolish now, do I? That doesn't mean you have Taco Bell green sauce, dip fuck! Yeah, Clyde, why do you think that shit's glowing? Maybe because of the three varieties of chili peppers. Just give us a stick, asshole. Or what? You'll beat me up? Ha <laughs> ha! I've got another surprise for you. Ah! 
I'm gonna make love to you, woman. Ah! Big ass! Get him, Commander Douchebag! This all makes sweet love. Ah! Cal. Burn them! Burn them! 
だ Your eons of torment are at an end, ruler of darkness. Uh, okay, um, you know what? I'm not playing anymore. You have broken the rules of the stick, and for that, I banish thee. I banish thee from space and time! Ah! <laughs> we did it, dude! That was awesome. You did it. Your noble quest is at an end. And for all your deeds, and all your time put into this, I hereby promote you to King Deucebag. Congratulations! Quickly! Now let's get this stick back to safety before anyone can do... We've got him! We've got the Dragonborn! Dragonborn? What the... Who, what? So, it really is the Dragonborn. Just can't stop being a thorn in our side, huh? He has the stick of truth. How does this guy know you, King Douchebag? King Douchebag? Is that what you told him your name was? Why didn't you tell them your real name, Dovahkiin? You don't remember, do you? How we tried to find you? Look, that stick belongs with the Fighters of Zaron. Give it back. Fighters of Zaron? Boys, what's going on here is much more complex than that. This isn't the first time a UFO has crashed to Earth. You see, in 1947, a UFO crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. Oh, God. Oh, brother, spare us. Hang on a sec. A UFO crashed in Roswell, and a new government agency was created to investigate the paranormal. Our agency. Can we skip this? Like, hit the skip button or something? Oh, you don't want to skip this. Yes, we do. Whenever aliens are spotted, vampires run amok, our agency is there, and we have never lost a fight. That is... Until four years ago, when we investigated a child. Yawn, yawn, yawn. A child who had an unnatural power inside him. I had orders from the president to secure the child so that we could harness his powers before our enemies could. But he slipped through our hands. The government wants the new kid for his farts? That's dumb. His farts? No. His amazing ability to make friends so quickly on any social network. Before he was five years old, he had 3.2 billion friends on Facebook alone. Do you have any idea the power that kind of gift yields in today's world? It's time to come with us, Dovahkiin. Time to stop resisting and use your gift for your country. Is he really still talking? Are we so different, you and I, Dovahkiin? Uh... You have to do what the government tells you to do, just like me. We're all just pawns in their game. I'll admit you are fascinating. You have more power than any child I've ever come across, and yet all you seem to really care about is this. It must be very important. What does it do? Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, dumbass. Yeah, stupid. Controls the... But then... I wouldn't have to do what I was told anymore. I could... <laughs> I control the universe! Get back! Back, I say, all of you! I can do anything, anything I want! <laughs> I no longer need you, new kid! I control the universe! Ah! 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 Damn thing! How does it work? Show me how it works! Yeah, right. Dovahkiin, why should we be on the opposite sides? Join me, Dovahkiin. Rule by my side. Rule. And you can have this all to yourself forever. I can offer you all. Just get me safely out of here. You can rule with this once again. You underestimated the character of the fighters of Zaron. What binds us is more than that relic. And you failed to recognize the character of our alliance. Yes, and that friendship is more important to any of us than even the stick of truth. Dude, where are you going? <laughs> Princess Kenny! At least one of you has some sense. You'd sell us all out? But why, Princess Kenny? Because Princess Kenny was born a half-orc, whose entire village was wiped out by humans and elves. Morgan Freeman? You see, when humans and elves lived together in the forest of Hollow Falls, 
An elven queen fell in love with the orc known as Dandar, the first one to possess the Stick of Truth. They loved in secret and had a child. A beautiful little girl, a girl who watched as everyone she loved was killed in cold blood. And that is why she waited and plotted all this time to take the stick from you. For Princess Kinney is true heir to the Stick of Truth. Wow, that's pretty cute. Just one thing, Morgan Freeman. How come every time something convoluted needs explaining, you show up? Because every time I show up and explain something, I earn a freckle. Ooh, 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 ooh. Princess Kitty, come back here! With the dragon. Hey. Welcome. Can I interest you in some of my wares? Princess Kenny, you don't want to go down like this, Beth.
you've been terrific. I think all the dying is making her tired. Keep killing her. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Guinea. Give these vermin a taste of their own medicine, Princess Guinea! No! Where are you going with Princess Guinea's rat? Damn you! Well, what are we waiting for? Ooh, I better ca catch my breath. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Guinea! I'm rubber your glue! She doesn't stay dead! We can't beat her! Two, we're fucked! There's no way! There is one way! We're gonna have to break the gentleman's code! What? Carmen! You can't possibly need- What other choice do we have, Cal? King Douchebag! You remember long ago, I made you swear an oath to never fart on anyone's boss. I am now asking you to break that oath. He's right, it's our only chance. Fart on Princess Kitty's boss, King Douchebag! Do it! Now, King Douchebag, fart on Princess Kitty's boss! What about the gentleman's oath? What? We're back to normal. We're, we're cured! We're all better now, Daddy. That's right, son. The Dragonborn must have farted on a princess's balls. You guys sure about this? There's no other way. It drove our friend to madness and nearly killed us all. So what do you guys want to play now? How about dinosaur hunters? Or pharaohs and mummies? Let's ask Douchebag! What do you want to play next, dude? Screw you guys. I'm going home. Wow, what a dick. <laughs>